Hi everyone. In this project, we will create a form using Python. Then we will export the information entered by the user to the Excel file. We will rebuild the project step by step together. You can subscribe to YouTube channel for more programming projects. I am transferring the necessary libraries. I choose the theme type of the desktop window. I will create a layout list. Now I just add a text object. I will send the layout list and window title to the window function. I need a while loop so that the window does not close. I am reading the data. I want to app to close only when exit or close buttons are pressed. I create a desktop window with the text object. I have added a few more objects. I add the text and input objects. I am adding new objects for the city option. I add combo box and text objects for color selection. I need to add some objects once again for language selection. I add a spin box object to specify number of the children. I have led three buttons. The parameters sent to the function represent the event value. I will use these values shortly when adding the text function. The design is complete. We haven't added the text function to buttons yet. I define a text function for the clear button. With the for loop, I can synchronize all objects with none. The function needs to be called when the clear button is pressed. I need an if query. I want it to call function if the value event is equal to clear. When the clear button is pressed, it replaces all values with none. I want the information entered by the user to be transferred to the Excel file when the submit button is pressed. I will create an Excel file in the project file. I can do the reading process with the read exam. I am combining the data using the concat function when the submit button is pressed by the user. T 
Thanks to the submit button, I will send all the information entered by the user to the Excel file. Let's do an example. When the submit button is pressed, the data is sent to the Excel file. Then all data was replaced with none. Let's do a few more examples. Thanks for watching. If you have any questions, you can specify them in the comments. You can subscribe to YouTube channel for more programming projects.